This uh, painting activity is called Feather Duster Painting. It's one of my very favorites. Uh, it's from an old, old art curriculum book called Creative Art for the Developing Child, and that was by Ch Claire Cherry, who wrote a lot of uh, 1960s and 70s curriculum books. To do this one, you need feather dusters, and typically I get them at someplace like Target or CVS, and then paint works really well on a tray, and pastel is really nice for this. Um, typically I use brown butcher paper, but obviously I'm doing my little uh, pandemic trying to figure out um, a solution for not having any butcher paper so this is a paper bag that I've cut up so I'm um, you know maybe just one color and white or two colors and white um, and so what we do is we have the tray available not for dogs and then children can just kind of get messy with the feather duster uh, and a suggestion that they make in the book is that you can do this painting and let it, the kids, you know, just kind of get as much paint on there as they want and then um, let it dry and come back another time and paint over the top of it, maybe with a darker color or maybe if you haven't used white, just doing white over the top of it and it just makes a really beautiful end product, although of course the product isn't what we're going for. Um, and obviously these get pretty soggy when they start to get paint on them and um, they, they clean up really nicely. So after you've used them, if you just um, wash them with some soap and then kind of shake them out and let them dry, they will become this beautiful fluffy thing again. All right, that's feather duster painting.